Hello and welcome to everybody on Cloud Fitness. So in today's video, I am going to show you how we can add a null value to a column in a date spark data frame so this is pretty short topic and in case you're not aware on you know how to add null values to a column in a spark data frame this video will be very helpful to you but before moving on do remember to share and subscribe to my channel in case you're liking the videos so let's move on to the portal and see how we can do it so in this case, as usual, I'm using my, you know, iris.csv file, which I have placed at the DPFS location. So let me go to this particular location in the file store and tables. And here I have my iris.csv file. So this is the file that I have and I want to use this particular file to create a data frame, right? So this is how I am creating a data frame over here, right? So, and once I create the data frame and I display it, this is how the data looks like. Now, if I want to add a new column to it and give null value to it, then how can I do it? So remember that the null that you see here, right? This is a hard coded null. Now, in my case, I don't want to, you know, hard code the null, right? It does not have to be, it has to be a void. It, it should not be a varchar. Now, in this case, it is varchar, right? In my case, what I'm trying to say is the null value should be the void one right now in this case what i can do i can simply use let me in fact zoom it as well now in this case what i can simply do is i can say okay using this particular data frame i'm using with column now with column is used for multiple purpose now this is one use case of with column you, you know i'm using df dot with column that this data frame i want to add a new column the name of the new column is null column and after that i am saying literal and inside literal i am saying none now if i do this like this is called literal lit is actually called literal you have to import this literal before you know running this particular command so how do you import it you import it from pyspark.sql.function you import this lit function now once once you do it once you import this lit function inside the lit you have to give none as the parameter then only you will be able to use it for adding null values now if i say display of df2 right now if i say display of df2 i should see my data frame with a new column and you know the value should be null right if you see over here right this is the column and the value is null now if i you know open this uh in fact let me go up a bit now if i open this as well you can see i have an i have a new column you know null column and even the data type is void because this is void also remember that in case let's say instead of none if i say you know uh, let's say none underscore varchar right now if i do this and i run this right now the things will be completely changed now you can see that the null column is not void it is string right it will default take this value which you have provided inside it and now if i do if i run this display df2 right now you can see this value will change to none varchar right so this is the difference this lit function use along with the with column can be used to add you know your varchar values your string values as well as your none values none or your null values right it can be used for both right so this is a very short thing that i wanted to share with you so do remember to like share and subscribe and let me know in the comment section if you have any doubts thank you so much